Hey guys, this is Jessie of Dirt Don't Hurt Adventures, and I just want to do a quick recap of an Airbnb we stayed at in Singers Glen, Virginia. This was a 12 by 20 cabin on two and a half acres with a pond. It is two floors, and on the first floor, they have a full kitchen with all the amenities, so if you want to stay in and cook, you definitely can. They also have your living area. There is no TV, though, or internet. There is a little coffee bar here, and they provide you with free locally roasted coffee. They have some teas, hot ciders, hot chocolate, and decaf coffee. They also provide you with free bottled water and jugs of water because they don't want you drinking out of the tap. You'll notice on the shelf and actually below the coffee bar, they have plenty of books and games for the kiddos too. On the first floor is where you're gonna find the one and only bathroom. There is a stand-up shower stall in here, and you'll notice on the shelf they have plenty of towels. You will not run out. They have washcloths, hand towels, and just your regular towels. Plenty of toilet paper, too, so you won't have to worry about that. And you'll notice as you check in and you're reading the rules, it's going to tell you um, do not get makeup on their towels, but they do provide you with, like, cleaning wipes to take your makeup off. The shower had plenty of hot water, plenty of pressure, no issues with that whatsoever. And when you go up into the second floor, this is where the bedroom is. They have bunk beds and then just a regular bed. And then you'll notice when you get close to one of the beds, they leave little Andy's mints on the bed for you, which I thought was a really nice touch. Very comfortable beds. We slept like babies. If you're wondering about cell service, we had Verizon and had no issues, but I did read online that a few of the other carriers, they did not have service. As you can see, here's the pond where you're allowed to fish, but you have to use barbless hooks and it's catch and release only. And you can see the power lines running above that had a ton of lures hanging off of it, so be careful before you cast. The house comes with a swing set, a picnic table outside, a fire ring with firewood, and chairs. There's also a kayak that you can use. There is a charcoal grill and they will provide you with charcoal for five dollars or you can bring your own. Another great thing about this cabin is it's only 45 minutes away from Shenandoah National Park. We would definitely stay here again. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to like and subscribe to our channel.